Baseball is back, as the 2022 season gets going with a seven-game slate on Thursday. The 53-47 vote elevated the first black woman to the pinnacle of the judicial branch as senators erupted in cheers. Three Republicans joined Democrats in supporting President Biden's nominee. Stock indexes mostly rose on Thursday as investors snapped up beaten down shares, while the US dollar climbed to its highest in nearly two years and the US Treasury 10-year yield touched a three-year high following hawkish signals from the Federal Reserve. Ukraine asks for heavy weapons as Russian strikes increase. Saki slammed Texas Governor Greg Abbott over his announced plan to bus illegal immigrants caught while entering the United States to Washington, D.C. Just 13 and a half months after a car crash left Woods with leg injuries so severe that doctors considered amputation, he returned to Augusta National with a one-under-par opening round on Thursday.